Okay, I'm about 25 feet off the ground, tucked into my lofty perch about 2 p.m. on a beautiful November afternoon. Temps have come down into the 50s, and the woods are really thinning out. The underbrush is losing its foliage, and you can see for a long way, so I should be able to see some deer coming if I have any action tonight. I actually jumped Mama and two little fawns on the way in. They were on their feet moving. Um, you know, the rut is coming on strong now, and the deer around here are chasing. I actually saw two dead deer on the interstate driving up here. So it's a great time to look for that big buck you're hunting. But it's also a good time to put meat in the freezer. I've got the whole week off, so I doubt I'm going to hold off. If I have some does come in or something tonight, I'm probably going to go ahead and put some meat in the freezer because I do have the whole week, and uh, it's time to fill it up. The, all deer are generally more active during the rut. Now I'm going to get quiet here and spend a little time enjoying this last of this beautiful fall foliage. As fate would have it, it was good that I had enjoyed that fall foliage because the wind and the rain had its way with it the following day. But that made it easier to watch the endless parade of deer go by, engaged in their annual breeding rituals. I also took some time to appreciate some of the other wildlife that was sharing the trees with me. I would have numerous close encounters with small bucks that I chose not to shoot and even learned how to sit very still when those small bucks bedded down within 50 yards of me. Towards the end of the week, it would be Dana who was presented with a good clean shot nice dough for our freezer. So I'm here working on processing Dana's deer. And this is a blessing. You can see the rut can be about more than just killing a big buck. All the deer tend to be more active. It's a great time to put some meat in the freezer too. Especially if you and your wife have already taken a few bucks, as Dana and I did back in October. If you want some tips, you butcher in your own game at home save a little money, be sure to check out some of our home processing videos. Our gun season's getting ready to open. Hopefully, we'll have some more videos coming for you soon. www.com.